Martin. This one is all made possible by our friends at Ahmed A. Siddiqui for D4G Promotions. This one is sponsored by Everlast, Sports Direct and Kinetic. And guess what? It's going to be broadcast across the globe on ESPN Plus in the United States of America, on Channel 5 in the United Kingdom and Ireland, on ABC, CBN in the Middle East and Dubai, TFC over in the Philippines and on IFL TV for the rest of the world. Massive card for you. And first up, it is time for our two men involved in this incredible main event to step onto the scales. Now, before we introduce them, just on behalf of all the team behind this legacy event and all the team down here at the Lever Hotel, and of course, all of our international viewers, this is an event that is being conducted uh, within a COVID protocol bubble. All of the fighters uh, have been within that bubble that allows us to remove our face masks uh, for the official weigh-in uh, and for the press conference yesterday. Uh, all of the fighters, all involved, will be tested regularly for by PCR uh, for COVID-19 uh, in line with, of course, the restrictions of the COVID protocol uh, here in Dubai and across the UAE. Ahmed is alongside us as well for the official uh, weigh-in. So he'll be observing uh, on behalf of all the team at D4G Promotions. But first up, as we said, two men involved in this incredible main event will be stepping onto these scales. First then, the challenger. He is the former super bantamweight, the former featherweight champion of the world, and now looks to become the Island of Ireland's first ever three-weight world champion from Belfast, Northern Ireland. Carl the Jackal Frampton! Fifty-eight point nine kg is the official weigh-in for the jackal. Get confirmations from the boys. Yep, thumbs up from the judges. Fifty-eight point nine kg is the official. Fifty-eight point nine kg for Carl. So Carl weighing in officially at fifty-eight point nine. And now time for the reigning, the defending, the WBO Super Featherweight Champion of the World. Please welcome to the official weigh-in, Jamal Sympathy Herring! Official win is 58.7 kgs. So this is the big one. It is Super 5 versus the Jackal tomorrow night live here in Dubai. Hand checks for these two men showing a lot of respect in the lead up to this fight. This is the big one. 
the defense of the WBO Super Featherweight title. Handshakes all round for the judges. And a big thanks to our fighters. We will see them again tomorrow night right here in Dubai. Okay, time now for the reigning, the defending. Next in, for the way in. As we get thumbs up from the judges, we're ready to go for fight number two on the card. And I'd like to please welcome to the stage the former WBC International Super Lightweight Champion. Tomorrow, tomorrow night, he challenges for the WBO Intercontinental Super Lightweight title all the way from Belfast in Northern Ireland. Please welcome Tyrone! The mighty Celt, McKenna! Yeah, 63.3, the official, 63.3, the official. So big thanks to the mighty Celt, who will be in the ring. His opponent, Jankos Turov, is currently shredding off the last few ounces. Uh, he will weigh in a little later. It's just asked for a later weigh-in for us today. So we will, of course, bring that to you in due course. But, but of course, big thanks to Tyrone, the mighty Celt McKenna, for being with us here. Calling out his opponent. Okay, next it's time for one of America's brightest prospects. Taking on a very tough challenge in just his second professional fight. First up though, please welcome to the stage with a record of no fewer than 10 wins. Just one defeat. And nine of those 10 wins come in by KO. From Ghana, Richmond, Ashley. So Richmond will be onto the scales. And the official weigh-in is 61.7 kg. 61.7. Sixty-one point seven. As to his opponent now, hailing from Norfolk, Virginia, an incredible amateur who successfully won his professional debut in February via knockout. Please welcome from the United States, Keyshawn Davies. The official way and then 62.7 kgs.
Up next for you, we've got the return of a boxing legend. Don Inietes and Paulo Carrillo fight for the vacant WBO International Super Flyweight title. First then, please welcome to the stage with a record of 25 wins, seven defeats, one draw from Colombia, Paulo Carrillo. The official weigh-in is 52 kg, 52 kg. And next up, a legend. The former four-weight world champion, having won world titles at minimum weight, at light flyweight, at flyweight, and super flyweight. Please welcome to Dubai, from the Philippines, Donny Nietes. Fifty two point one kgs. That's fifty two point one kg. Carrillo against Nietes. Much anticipated. They face off here at the official way and they face off in the ring. On Blue Waters Island tomorrow evening, right here in Dubai. Next up, we turn our attention to a six-round contest. As we turn our attention to the remainder of the fights on the card tomorrow night. The six-round contest. Please welcome to the stage for the next weigh-in with a record of nine wins, 13 losses from Russia. Please welcome Evgeny. You was them.
66.6 kg, it's 66.6. And now the man, originally from Kolkata in India, now residing and living right here in Dubai. Five wins, no defeats for those wins coming by way of KO. It is Faizan Anwar. Weighing in at 67.2 kg, that's Vazem versus Anwar tomorrow night live in Dubai. Yeah. And next up for you. We have a four-round clash. Brilliant card to look forward to. Fighters from all over the globe. First up, please welcome to the stage from India with a record of two wins and just one defeat. It is the one named Suraj. Fifty eight point eight KG, it's fifty eight point eight. And his opponent with a record of three wins, one defeat. From right here in Dubai, the United Arab Emirates. Please welcome Kid Emirati Fahad Al Blushi. Sixty one point four. Correction sixty nine point four KG. Correction on that fifty nine KG. Face mask getting in the way again. So the official weigh in is fifty nine KG, five nine KG for the Kid Emirati. We've got one more for you. We are just waiting for the fighters to arrive into the official weigh-in arena. As soon as they do arrive, we will have that official weigh-in for you for another keenly anticipated fight. Big thanks to all those tuning in from across the globe. An international audience being generated. A lot of interest for this. Fight night of all fight nights right here in Dubai. Brought to you by Ahmed A. Siddiqui for D4G Promotions. Ahmed, thank you so much indeed to you and your team. D4G doing so much for fight and the fight game right here in Dubai and across the entire region. This one is sponsored by Everlast, Sports Direct and Kinetic. It's broadcast on ESPN Plus.
over in the United States of America, Channel 5 here in the UK, and of course Ireland, ABC, CBN in the Middle East and Dubai, TFC over in the Philippines, and on IFL TV for the rest of the world. We are just waiting for a couple more of the fighters to make their way down to the official weigh-in. The great and the good of the boxing game right here at the Lever Hotel, the Messiah Center here in Dubai for the official weigh-in. Attention then, of course, tomorrow evening will change to the Caesars Blue Waters Dubai. Bully. Jamel Herring defending his WBO super featherweight title against Carl Frampton, the top of that card for you. But as you've seen from the official weigh-in, so much to look forward to. A very international card. A lot of flags will be flown in the ring in Dubai tomorrow. So make sure you tune in for what promises to be first of its kind here in the region. And it will entertain from start to finish. Quick reminder that all of the fighters are in a COVID-19 bubble at the moment. COVID protocol is being respected as per the regulations of the Dubai municipality, the United Arab Emirates Ministry of Health, and all the other authorities who have worked so tirelessly to ensure that COVID-19 is tackled respectfully and efficiently right here in the UAE. So all of the fighters uh, within that COVID-19 bubble, there is regular PCR testing ongoing. And that's what has allowed us to come together for the fight card tomorrow evening right here in Dubai. So wherever you are in the world, make sure you do tune in for that one. Equally, if you are following on social media, then of course, keep it locked to our hashtag legacy event which will be live from Caesars Blue Waters Dubai tomorrow night. One more way in for you coming your way shortly. We'll have details on that in just a few moments.
Official way in. So we have the fighters in for another title fight right here in Dubai. Once we get thumbs up from the judges, we will be underway with the official way in. As Tosin by Kalakmet and Hiberondo on fight for the WBC International Super Welterweight title. So we will ask the Colombia, the Venezuelan, I should say, to come back into the weigh-in as well. And we'll ask he to go first. In fact, we will ask the man in just his third professional, weighing in at 69.8 kgs in just his third professional fight. The record of two wins, no defeats. And the defending WBC international super welterweight champion from Kazakhstan, Tursin by Kulakhmet. And his opponent for the WBC international super welterweight title is the man with a record of 20 wins, no defeats. 13 of those wins coming by knockout. The man from Venezuela. Wearing his flag loud and proud. Hiber Rondon. It's Rondon versus Kalakhmet. Tomorrow night in the title fight for the WBC International Super Welterweight title. Venezuela versus Kazakhstan. Ask the fighters to face the press. Heba Rondon weighing in at 69.7 kg a little earlier on. So, so much to look forward to tomorrow night here in Dubai.